everyone, and this is my friend Megan. Hello. And we're here in Dublin. And thanks for doing this with me. Oh, my pleasure. How old were you when you first started playing music? Seven. Yeah, the ripe old age of seven. The ripe old age of seven. And was that on the fiddle first? Or yeah, music? just the fiddle. And then, yeah. yeah. Cool. And now you also use your fiddle and you do looping and and all kinds of other things, and singing as well, you have a gorgeous voice. Thanks, girl. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I fell into singing kind of late, I guess. I was 17 when I started learning how to sing. 16? Yeah. No, I was 17. It's because I got um, tendonitis at the time, and uh, I was in an arts high school. And so they gave me a choice, they're like, you can do your final year, but like you can play with the sink, they're just going to play by then. So I didn't want to like, after having done three years of this intense study, I didn't want to just give it all up, you know? Yeah. So yeah, I just, they, they recommended a really good film teacher in Ottawa, and I was work to work that summer, and then all that year, and I'm still doing that for a long time. But then I just got sick of it. I just, just got yeah. better eventually. Yeah. 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 It took me a long time. Yeah. 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 There you go, and that's what you do now full time. It's yeah. So it, yeah. So, it, so many more gigs now because of it. Yeah. <laughs> so many. <laughs> And who is your biggest musical influence? Oh, I think... Um, that's a pretty really good question that I just never think about. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's really hard. Um, at the minute, I'm big into like uh, different buskers. Um, so I'm really... I've been listening to a lot of like Tash Sultana, um, Mumford and Sons, they're groovy. Uh, Hosier, also groovy. Mm -hmm. London Grammar. I've actually been listening to a lot of London Grammar lately. I love when they use the synth. Um, it's sick. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I've been getting into them a lot. Yeah, yeah. they're really good. Her voice is haunting. It's yeah. so beautiful. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Right on. Who is your favorite fiddler? Oh my gosh, it's really hard. I <laughs> know. Oh, <laughs> that's really hard. Ah, I think Alistair Fraser at the minute. And Natalie McMaster. Yeah. She's always definitely and forever. Yeah, totally. She's my hero. She's yeah. always been my hero. And you grew up you grew up in Canada, but now you live in Dublin. Yeah, full time I do music in Dublin. More work for a fiddle player here than in Ottawa. <laughs> so <Yeah. laughs> it's great. Awesome. And uh, yeah, lots lots of different projects going on in the city all the time. So cool.
was the most favorite place that you've traveled to for music? Ooh, good question. Um, I really, mm, I really loved Japan. It was my first ever tour, but I think partially because it was my first tour, everything was incredible <laughs> to begin with. But the people there, um, the nature that was just in the middle of the city a lot of the time, they had gorgeous temples. Um, it was just so spectacular, it was breathtaking. And uh, yeah, I was there for an Irish dance show, and so it was a really nice experience and that with such a cool group of people, and we all kind of had this shared experience the whole time. It's cool. beautiful, really cool. <laughs> and, it, and the sushi, of course. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, food. good sushi. <laughs> great food, great seafood. Yeah. Okay. Last question What is your favourite dessert? Oh, cheesecake. Cheesecake! Oh, you know, I'm lactose intolerant, but I love it. <laughs> Oh, hard life, hard life. Oh, I feel you on that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's so good. Yeah. Cool. Well, thank you so much for doing this. It's Come amazing, too. It's so good to yeah. see you. Come back soon. Oh, I will. Don't you worry. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no doubt. Yeah. All right. <laughs> thank you. Hang on to your seats, folks. <laughs>